Hey everybody, everyone's Zaz here, back again with another episode of Inspiraction. Happy Easter! You might be wondering why I am driving right now and filming. I, I, it's becoming like a normal thing for me, I know, but I'm actually on my way to give this camera case back to Carolyn Campbell, who um, played an April Fool's joke on me and my family. So... Uh, I didn't I didn't share a video with you yesterday just because I wanted to condense it all today and I was having too much fun and so basically first up on Inspiraction my friend Leslie conducted my first official interview on social media so that was a lot of fun her and her friend Megan came up and uh, and Mike Newman thank you for getting the extra footage here um, to, to interview me for that so that was awesome and then second up on Inspiraction is well a couple things um, I ate my first hard-boiled egg that was cool and funny. Got about a minute of footage there. You're going to laugh. And then, uh, secondly, got to go to a new bar last night called The Snug. It's like an Irish-English kind of pub bar thing. And the cool thing about The Snug is you get these little... They're, they're snugs. You go in these little tiny rooms, boxed out from the rest of the bar, and you can show it just like a few people in there. And ours was actually right up on the bar, so we had the bartender all to ourselves. So I'm going to show you some of that too. And then um, basically I had a blast with my 50-year-old friends last night. My mom's friends, my dad's friends, and well, they're my friends too, Rich and T. Holla, love you guys. And uh, oh, lane change here. And um, yeah, uh, capping off the night, our drunk asses went and basically paid Carolyn back. So I've got all of that practical joke footage on camera here. I'm not going to reveal it. You just have to keep watching to find out. So have a happy Easter Sunday. I love you guys. Make it a great day. Bye. Hi, this is Aaron Gonzalez. Welcome to Inspiraction. I do something brand new every single day that I have never done before. So I'm here tonight with my friend Leslie. Hi. And Mike. And Megan. Yeah, and what are you guys doing tonight for me? What what's going on? This is a class project and we're talking about social media. Woo! And how important it is. And Abram is our spokesperson and how Inspiraction is a huge milestone in social media. Bueno, so that's what we're doing today. I guess my first professional interview cuz they are rocking it with the lights and <laughs> all of it. Uh, for instance, I think one of the greatest things about Facebook is the fact that everybody's wearing a sign that says, I like baseball, or I like dancing, or whatever, and it's so easy to walk up to that person and say, like, oh, I love baseball, and I love dancing, too. You know, that's, that's one of the greatest powers of Facebook and social media. It's the fact that you can easily relate and connect with people based on what they're already showing you, what they're talking about. And then how does that mold and shape relationships? Social media is real. It's, it's an extension of what you're already doing. You know, I was able to, I mean, when I, when I met up with these people, I met up with three people that day that I'd never met before, and it was like, like we'd known each other for a million years. You know, it sounds all cheesy and stuff, but really, I've been having conversations with some of them for months. I just hadn't met them physically, so... And did you feel kind of like a weird disconnect when you first saw them? Like, oh, well, I've been up behind a computer screen, you've been behind a computer screen, and now we're actually in the real. Was it anything like that, or what do you think? I would say no. Really? Um, the past few experiences with people that I've met uh, online first and then offline, uh, well, at least I think maybe the differences between some of these people is I've seen them in video, and that's also the power of like what I do, is I do video every single day, and so people see just, they see a lot more than my words, they see a lot more than what I'm talking about, you know, on Facebook chat or, you know, in your, in your news feed. Uh, you get a real piece of me, you get, you get all my emotion, you get to see me, and so the same was true when I met up with, like, Gabe and my friend Megan, too. It was just like, I already know you, I already know what you're like, I already, I'm already used to your demeanor and everything, too, and so it wasn't anything foreign, there were no surprises, it was, uh, it was really interesting. Never. Lots of firsts, lots of firsts. So apparently the cool thing about the snug is that you have a snug for yourself. Here's the bar. Here's the snug. <laughs> and here's our private party room. <laughs> snug. This is the snug. Get inside. It's a snug. Can we close the door and just take it? Yeah, this is us. This is us. Seriously? And we can talk. And we have the bartender access right here. We got the one that we wanted, totally. Right. 
Hey everybody, welcome to Inspiraction. Avery Gonzalez here. And uh, looks like we got a big, big mess on our hands this morning. A bunch of uh, little chicks hatched. I mean, this poor guy didn't even, didn't even make it. You know, these guys are here. So this is what the sign says. Tetradecagon peeps. All this stuff. Hatched April 1st, yada, yada, yada. Well, funny thing is, my mom and I were speaking about our dear friend, Miss... Oh, shit, I'm sorry. Carolyn Campbell. I almost said Carolyn Collins. Um, Carolyn Campbell. And long story short, done a lot of pranks on each other. My mom on her, her on my mom over the years. And now that they're finally called out also... I tend to believe that this is her work. And it's so funny that she did it because my mom and I have something big, big, big planned up our sleeves for her yard. So stay tuned. I'm going to show you that. And we're going to totally her yard later. What? What? You're just going to have to find out. Take a look. Got the links below. Bye. Did you expect this tonight, Spencer? I did not. You did not. I did not. What did to me. <laughs> That's so funny, she left her camera case there. <laughs> I wonder if I left my keys here. <laughs> oh, I hard enough. F O R K U Fork U <laughs> Totally ridiculous. Thank you, Spencer Campbell, no problem, for hosting the um forking of the your fork parents' stuff. house. <laughs> no yeah. problem. Thanks, buddy. You had no idea, but now it's here. Asta. Go, 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 go. Go. She spins. I did it so we could see people. It's okay. Concert of the driving. Oh I need a straw. Straw. I am for Coleo. I want to quote that. I am for Coleo. I am for Coleo. You can tag me on that one. I've returned to the scene of the crime, and it is already gone. Darn it! I wanted to get the footage, but I need to show you the rabbit. I need to show you. Show you what Carolyn did to us 15 years ago. And this April Fool's joke goes very, very deep. So I'm going to show you that. And um, give Carolyn her camera case back that she uh, managed to drop in our front yard. Giving her totally away. Not that we didn't already know who it was. So I'm back here at the scene of the crime. And they still have the sign. But I put it back out here in front. I'm going to leave the camera case here in the rabbit's ears. But um, So my mom made this Easter bunny a long time ago and put it in our yard. It's like a, a wood thing and anyway the real picture is the Easter bunny behind here is holding a, holding a, like a, a basket of eggs. Well, Carolyn thought it would be hilarious to come out, trace it, and then make this on it. <laughs> so she made him uh, moon everybody and so that was the practical joke and if well, you can see right here, it says April Fool's. Um, on the back side of this piece of paper, it says April Fool's 1995. So my mom held on to this thing for like 16 years. And so now it's back in Carolyn's hands. Uh, families hadn't been together in a long time. And now we're back again in the same community. And so, um, yeah, we, we definitely got her back. My work here is done. That's it for Inspiration. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great day.